Hi, I'm Lovely, and welcome to part 5, I think this is part 5, of my Lost Via Domus playthrough. Hi! Uh, I haven't played the last couple days because I've been kind of sick, um, and it's been, I've kind of had a nice break, but I'm ready to get back into more Lost. Uh, I think I have two episodes left, and I am not sure if I'm going to do all of it tonight, or if I'm going to split it into two parts. We'll see. But yeah, last one, we we did something with the hatch. We either like shut it off or something. <laughs> um, all I know is the start of this episode is going to be us running from the smoke monster. And I'm pretty excited. I'm pretty excited to see where this goes. I don't really have any predictions. Uh, I'm lovely. Let's get into this. Uh, continue. Let's select this one. Let me look at the time. <laughs> oh, my, my Xbox is... What is this? Three hours ahead? That's funny. Okay. <laughs> it's uh, 10.33 right now. Dude, I've got to say, I didn't think we were going to survive through the night. Yeah, and also, yeah, look at this. Okay, so we're actually going to go to the, like, the house of the others. This is kind of crazy. Okay. Previously on Lost, Suite 42, <laughs> Hotel Persephone. Tonight, Savo's cooking a deal. I've been tracking Savo for so long. If we work together, we can get past that guard, up to his room, and get photos of what he's doing. I talked about it a lot, a lot last time, but this interpretation of what's like under the hatch or whatever is kind of crazy. We know what you did and we will find you. I'm really curious on to what we did. My controls are vibrating. Here's the smoke monster. All right, we're we're getting like a temple run section, right? This is so cool. We're we gonna be jumping over the smoke monster and shit. Oh, I misread that. I misread that completely. I have I have already died. <laughs> that was very quick. <laughs> that was very quick. Uh, restart. Um, I gotta say I've been really liking this game so far. The checkpoint is before the cutscene. Maybe I spoke too soon. Um, no, it's been really nice doing this because it feels like I'm just seeing more loss, just a different story in it. And it's really interesting seeing this after only seeing the show. But this this is really interesting. I want to know, how did we get this compass again? I can't remember. I can't remember. Okay. Um, Let me try not to die. Can I skip the cutscene? I cannot. Doesn't seem like I can. Okay. Um, but no, I, I'm, I think I'm ready to finish this, though. Uh, I am going to be sad, because then I have consumed whatever lost stuff is out there. Um, but no, no. It, it, it is going to be a little sad finishing this, but I think I'm ready to be finished as well. Okay, so we're going to jump. I misread. Oh, God. Holy shit, it's right on me. It's right on me. I'm dead. I'm just dead. I'm I'm gonna have to watch the fucking cutscene again. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so sorry everybody. <laughs> Restart previously on loss. Jesus Christ, never set a checkpoint before a cutscene that is <laughs> So yeah, when they make the second game, I'm, e I'm expecting it to be a little bit better. <laughs> no, this is super cool. I wouldn't, I really, I know it'll never happen, because why would it? Um, but when I was looking up this game to see how long it was, I saw some people asking for content that takes place in the last three seasons. Um, and that's never going to happen. I'm pretty sure we're, in my lifetime, we're never going to see another Lost video game. I think we might see a reboot at some point, like in in the future um 
but like I don't think we're gonna get a game. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alright. Let's see if I could do this. Let's see if I could do this. Oh, oh, I didn't realize I had to control me running. Holy shit, I'm so oh my god, everybody. Okay, so I should only slide when it's like right in front of me. Like, I tried predicting it. Okay. Get ready to jump. Not gonna lie, I'm like, I'm... Oh... fell from a cliff previously oh let me skip this please tonight Savo's cooking a deal oh my god <laughs> what what happened so I started this at 1033 it is 1039 so at least six minutes of this uh last and last uh, in last episode uh, last part I had to put up some time stamps because I played horribly and I got stuck on like two sections. Maybe I'm gonna have to do that again. It's always funny because this feels so long to me. I remember when um, because I did a playthrough of Portal before this, like uh, on my channel, and this part feels so long in the moment, like right now as I'm recording it. But when I'm looking at it after, it's, it's kind of like it didn't take like to, like to me this feels long, but it's only been six minutes. <laughs> um. So it's not too bad, but <laughs> this. Oh my god! <laughs> it's nice getting to hear Elliot, though. I don't. I feel like we don't get to hear him enough in this game. I'm not super confident in my in my thumbstick, so I could fall off fall off super easily. Holy shit, that was close. Oh, you are you are a little too confident in yourself, game. What the fuck? Look, all of that part is fine. It's just the fact that, uh... It's just the fact that there's no, um, what is it? Checkpoint. <laughs> beforehand. That was a little fun thing. I wouldn't mind that. I wouldn't mind that more, but holy shit, that was, that was scary. It looks like we're gonna get more of the others this time, I think. It's kind of like we got separated from the rest of the group, so we, we don't have to worry about too many of the details now, I think. Are we going to see the flashes? Interesting. This is cool. They're doing the echo thing. This is so cool. The cutscene is a little janky, but that's okay. Huh. Okay, so... Hmm. I wonder what the the MIB saw in us. I can understand why he would keep us alive. We, we're kind of shitty. With the magnetic interference neutralized, my compass is giving me a new heading. I need to follow it and find the way home. Okay, that's the same. That's the same. That's the same. I'm just making sure. Okay. Uh, Lisa was after a story about a, n a man named Savo, some scientist who seems to have shady connections, but Lisa didn't trust me to help her with the story. I beat Lisa to R Rico's place. She was after information on Savo, but Rico decided to give me the info instead. Guess that's what she got for trying to keep it a secret from me. It's related to her sister dying, though. 
Um, <laughs> you know? Okay. By the way, I'm very glad that we haven't gone through another cave. I feel like it's going to have to happen now. Um, what's my inventory looking like? Oh, my inventory is full. Well, I guess we just try to walk through these thingies and die, right? <laughs> Juliet! I wouldn't do that if I were you, Elliot. <laughs> like if this was be like to me this I'm, I'm gonna be honest this is pretty good I think the fact that we got something like this is still kind of crazy um, but this could have been a lot worse like it has all the things that I feel like make makes it lost but you know just a little janky you move between these pylons and you'll be dead Elliot I'm here to help you Okay, pylons, thank you. You stuck me with a needle. Yeah, sorry about that. We needed a DNA sample. Okay. Uh, why should I trust because you? I can help you remember. The night before you left on Oceanic 815, Lisa Gellhorn's body was found in Sydney Harbor, shot dead. Elliot, you killed her. Did I? How do you know my name? I a lot about you. Much more than you do. Oh, I wanted to ask more stuff. There were more questions. Did I kill her? That's crazy if if I did. Also, I don't know how the others get this kind of information. <laughs> like, I really don't. Like, it seems like they, um... Let me pause real quick. Like, from, mem from my memory in the show... The others get them the information because they do they do research on us. Um, but if we're doing like let's say secret stuff, they really shouldn't be able to get that information, uh, right? Something like that. Um, unless Jacob helped them out or something. Oh, I can't remember anything. Did I kill her? So I need a picture of a dude and there's a gun. All right. Um, can I move? Damn, missed it. I'm not going to move my camera. I know this woman's boobs are like in the way, but I'm not focusing on that. I'm trying to. <laughs> of course. It's Thank all you. Coming back. Elevite is closed. Je suis une cliente. J'aimerais accéder à ma chambre. Elevator. Closed. The gun out in the open is crazy. Okay, well, let me try to get the things. Let me examine diary. Yes, okay, Sydney, Australia, Friday, September 17, 2004. Savo's arranged a secret meeting somewhere in Sydney. What's he meeting about? More importantly, who is he meeting with? Um, okay, let me look around. Sir, can I go near you? <laughs> oh, I can talk to the bodyguard. Savo lashes out at pseudoscience accusations. Sydney, Australia, Zoran. Savo lashed out at reports the... I forgot how they pronounce this. Chenchi? Uh, Institute of Research is spending millions on extra uh, sensory perception research. Our facility has never supported research based on empirical evidence, said the Institute's president, adding, the brain is simply not capable of ESP. It is pseudoscience at its worst. And now we have to look for an audio thing. I love how much copy and paste there's in this. Whatever it takes. Um, okay, guestbook. Okay, let's try to talk to the guard. I see we could talk. Interesting that we can talk to two people here. The thing is, one of these activates the cutscene, and it seems to be the guard. Wait. Got the time. 
You were a hotel employee? I like I've been trained in customer service. Bugger off. <laughs> okay. Interesting that we could do that, though. That's cool. Interesting. Alright, Lisa, I'm ready. We can move on. That guy's <laughs> no Thai fisherman. Oh. Oh. Interesting. So I think we're going to play this out and then go back to Juliet. Okay, well, it's a whole ass thing. I'll talk Careful, to him. Elliot. These aren't people you mess with. One of us needs to run interference. Yeah, but I have more dialogue options. What the fuck? What happened to them? I thought I had more. All right. One of us needs to... Okay, so now I talk to him. Oopsies, my bad. Hey, I'm here to talk. Am I speaking freaking French to you? Le elevator, el closed. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of French. A hundred bucks to use the elevator. Right, this seems like the move. Five that says it's closed. Now back off, mate. That woman over there, she's a journalist. Crazy, okay. That woman over there, she's a journalist. How do you know that? I don't appreciate nosy reporters asking me busy questions. Who's this Sabo she's on about anyway? This is crazy. We're selling her out right now to fucking use this? That's so fucked up. You, let's go. Hey, let me go. Keep it quiet, sweetheart. What are you doing? Let go of me! Dude, we suck. <laughs> Holy shit. I want to know more. I want to know what's going on there. We're an asshole. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like I didn't talk much during that section. I've kind of just been playing. There was a bodyguard. I didn't kill Lisa. Yeah, interesting. I'm, was Juliet maybe trying to test us? Careful. Don't get too close to the fence. I didn't kill her. on how you look at it, Elliot. You betrayed her, and that's just as bad. But I read your file, and I think I understand what Lisa saw in you. Even if Ben does I'm kind of on Ben's side. We're, we're we're an asshole. Wait, she had more dialogue options. Oh, she's turning the shit off. You can come through now. It's powered down. Can I talk to you? This is cool. Follow the underground path. The underground passage is the only safe path through this area. I need to use caution. The others are everywhere. <laughs> why are you helping me? Who is Ben? Oh, I could trade shit. Okay, okay. Well, let's say why are you helping me? I think Ben's wrong about you, Elliot Maslow. Thank you. He's Ben. The guy in charge. <laughs> what does Ben want with you, Elliot? I'm not sure you're still the man he thinks you are, but that's for you to decide. Also, I could definitely see how um, the fact that I betrayed her is the same as you know killing her. Because I mean, we 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 fucking we suck. All right, what do you got for me? I, I mean, honestly, just to clear up my inventory a bit, I might just buy more of these fuses. So let's just do one of each. Fifty fucking bucks? <laughs> Dude, I have I have a lot of shit. Okay, well let's let's do uh Let's conf let's confirm deal. Take it away. Thank you. Um, just in case, I want to spend forty bucks. So let's do.
let's buy one more of these because we don't know what's going to happen. Alright, I, I think that's a good move. I think that's a good move. I need to declare my inventory. Like, I I, I needed to buy some un, un, a, like useless shit. Alright, thank you, Juliet. Oh, let's see what you have to say. I hope you know how to handle that thing. Thank you. Keep it. You'll need it. This is interesting, so I'm gonna have to still fight others, I guess, because Juliet's helping me and, like, where you're hmm. heading. I have more, if you need them. <laughs> uh, no thanks. I'm a wine drinker. This is true. I think I remember her making wine. You'll need that lantern where you're going. Via Domus. That might be the most valuable item you have. Hmm. Do you need more? It's a fuse. Oh my god, why do they let us ask? More. Need one? <laughs> it's a fuse. Thank you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So they said where I'm going, I don't need the... Do you need? I don't really need this, so let me... Yeah, well, if I don't need it, then why are you selling it? That makes no sense. Alright, I'm gonna keep that. Alright. Bye, Juliet. Oh, what is, oh, what is this? Is that also the swan? Seemed to be in, like, a, a swan hatch. The flame. Hmm. I don't remember the hatch names too much, honestly. I believe there's six stations. <laughs> uh, let's enter the building. I'm ready. I'm ready. Also, I'm I I kind of want to finish this tonight. I'm not sure. No one can walk through the wilderness without leaving signs. Hmm. I must access the main floor if I ever want to get out of here. If there is really a way off this island, I must be getting close. That woman, did I just imagine her? Is my mind playing tricks? I remember seeing blood, a dead body. Who was the dead body and who's that woman? I don't know why I kept reading my bed. Oh, do they want me to use a torch during this section? So there was something to grab here. Okay, that's what I thought. <laughs> oh, more fuse puzzles. I just saw that. Hey, a pallet jack. This looks like the flame. That sounded like Mi Mikhail. That sounded like Mikhail. There's a fucking fence. Um, oh shit, okay. Well, let me... Let me pop out my torch just to see. Okay, well, let's go around here. Ah! They give us way too many fuses, <laughs> but I, I appreciate it. Because if you don't have enough, then I don't know what you're supposed to do. Thank you. Okay, we gotta go back this way. I should have made myself a cup of water before I started this. <laughs> 
always make that mistake sometimes but uh, when I start recording is like I do a lot of talking and my throat gets kind of dry damn okay uh, I think they want me to use a light <laughs> How do I get over there? Did I miss something? Am I silly? Uh, let me unequip because I can't run while I have that equipped. Yeah, I went through here. This thing is going to go out on me, and that's going to be unfortunate. <laughs> Damn. No, I, I was doing my the, the best I could, um, so I wouldn't have to go back to Juliet <laughs> to buy a fucking torch. What happens if I use, um, where's this lantern? Lantern. I'm glad this at least works, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to need this later on. Okay. Oh, I don't think I went through this. There's a fucking manual. Food drop protocol document. So this is how the food arrives. Handy. Except it doesn't say when or where the next drop is. Huh, did I miss something? Because I can't get through this door. Like, that looks like the way. And I, I assume... I assume they don't want me to just go all the way back. Like... Can I only explore this because of the food drops or whatever? Okay, I'm gonna go back one more time. Okay. I mean, I also have a gun, but I don't think I can do anything with that. Oh. A lot of fuses me. Okay. Okay, no, this is good though. I found uh
Oh man, when you have to pick up an object, you have to be looking at it in order to pick it up. That's, I want to say that's one of the bigger pet peeves I have during this game. You can't see it, but there's a lot of me just mashing A so I can pick something up. Give me all these fuses. Shit. Alright, let's reload. Okay, maybe I can go to Julia and trade for more fuel. Did I come from this way? I did not. Okay, okay, okay. Yes! Alright. Extinguish. I wonder if I unequip it, does that automatically extinguish it? I imagine. I imagine. Okay, well let's... This panel looks like it controls the gate block in the ladder. If I complete the circuit, the gate should open. Okay. This will be easy. I know how to do these at, these point, at this point. I have 29 fucking things. Okay. I like these puzzles, I really do. <laughs> okay, so instead of a plus sign, let's put that there. Oh fuck, I'm like right under. Uh oh. One, two, three, four. Thank you. 
Interesting. What am I doing wrong? So, hmm, I know I'm pretty silent during this. So, this needs to be more. And I'm using the least amount of stuff going that way, right? So, like, for example, if I do this, this should be, this should make it fine. Yeah. Hmm. But now this one is too high. Now this one is too high. They got me stumped. Okay, so I'm going to leave these ones here because those have to be there no matter what. Same with these. Like, I might not use these ways, like these uh, these paths down here and all the way up over here. Um, but if I do, then these pieces have to be there no matter what. So let's just, let's just see what happens if we do this. That's certainly not the move. Okay. <laughs> Then let's try that. That seems pretty good. I'm off by five. I'm off by five. One, two, three, four. I'm using one too many if I go this way. Like, so, okay, let's go. Let's break down the path. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wait, just five. But here, one, two, three, four, five. Damn. Damn, they got me stumped. No, and no matter what, this has to be the piece that goes right here. So, these have to be connected by different ways. Wait, wait. Fuck. I'm doing this so wrong. Okay. 
I'm sitting now. I'm sitting crisscross applesauce in my chair. I'm really focusing. I really love this. I really love these puzzles. I really do. So breaking this down, one, two. So you need the perfect amount of pieces for this, because it only hits it if this is here. Okay. What if I do this? No, that doesn't work. Like, let's just see, let's just do this real quick. Let's just see what happens. Okay, that part works, but now this would have to be like maybe this. Wow. Okay. That was cool. Now what happens if I take one? Alright, we're picking up all that shit. <laughs> I wonder if they gave us so many fuses because they didn't expect people to just pick to pick up their stuff. Alright, let's climb to the main floor. I swear that sounded like Mikhail. Um, maybe even the actor too. Shooting can be useful against hostiles in the jungle. Make sure make sure to always have enough ammunition. Thank you. Okay. When you're shot at, try to find rocks. Okay, I have a feeling I'm gonna need my gun. Oh, I can't I can't bring out my gun right now. Okay. Oh, oh, we are here. We are in the Saeed episode. Okay. Don't lie to me. I saw his file on your desk. <laughs> you are as stupid as you are clumsy. And you're as ballsy as you are ugly. I got a good feeling Lazarus coming. So uh, we'll just wait here together. Did Mikhail capture the dude that was trying to kill me? I'm going to go steal your food boxes. Oh, I don't have any. Let me... Let me, let me through. Let me through. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh oh, now I'm worried. Are we actually stuck? Okay. I want to look through as much of this place as I can before um, my cutscene starts. What does this say? Okay, that's, I believe, Russian. Damn. Yes. An old computer from the... Cool. Cool. Twenty-four, thirty-two, thirty-eight. Oops. Cool. Now, I'm pretty scared somebody is in this place. I'm fucking around with this. Can we do the chess match? I wonder. I doubt they programmed chess into this. Transmission. Royal News, London. Interview with Elliot Maslow. May 2nd, 1999. Why do it? Why voluntarily put yourself in a war zone to take a picture? I love photography. I love my career. I wouldn't let anything come between me and a photo. When I see a moment unfold, it's something I have to capture. When I feel most alive. But it's quite a risk. I would sacrifice anything for the right shot. What if a photo stopped a conflict? Or compelled people to action? Isn't that worth putting your life in jeopardy? Okay. <sighs> sorry, sorry, one sec. I was holding my breath <laughs> during that. Um... It was a little, it's, the volume was a little low on my side, so I actually had to, like, press my headphones in, and I was kind of just holding my breath to focus. Um, okay. Looks like they put the important thing. I would sacrifice anything for the right shot. Okay, okay. 
Why is our thing here? I forgot that we're Maslow. 38. Can we talk to Richard off island? The satellite dish is in up. Communications are down. For sonar access, enter 56. Wait a minute. Is it going to do the hostile thing? If I recall correctly, I saw this episode a few weeks ago. They're going to say, like, this is also down. Oh my god. Woo! <laughs> yeah, I know I could have looked through more of this. Um, but oh, I fucking died. <laughs> let me, um. <laughs> let me. Alright, well, let me pay attention more to the dialogue now that I know it's me. I saw his file on your desk. <laughs> you are as stupid. As you are clumsy, and you as ballsy as you are ugly. I got a good feeling Maslow's coming. So, uh, we'll just wait here together. Okay, well, now I know. I mean, I already, I already knew what that was gonna do, but I thought we were gonna escape and shit. Yes, I see him. To my left, I see the guy that was trying to kill me. Tell me what you know about Elliot Maslow. I'm certain I do not know what you are talking about. Dude, it's fucking Mikhail. I know they want me to open the door and aim, but I want to try to do it from here. Okay. You're a tough man to find, Elliot. Ha 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 ha! You're a tough man to find, Elliot. Dude, I was not wasting a second. Hi, what's up, man? Well done, Mr. Maslow. You've just killed the one person on this island who knows you from your past. Okay, I'm not sure if this is the same I actor, just but put the past behind me. I want answers now. All in good time, but for now, I must apologize. I am intimidated by this man. <sighs> who hit us? Was it the lady who had, uh, who had Walt? Sweet dreams, Elliot. Oh, hi, Juliet. That's not the end of the episode, is it? That's the end of the episode. Oh my god. Through the flame, follow the dog closely to find your way through the jungle. If you have a hard time keeping up, run. Um... Okay, guys, we're finishing. We're finishing this. No. Previously on Lost. Previously on Lost. That woman over there. She's a journalist. Okay. One second, because I am gonna stop my recording here. You, let's go. Um, but I, I have to let this play out what first. Are you doing? Let go of me. The night before you left on Oceanic Eight Fifteen. Lisa Gellhorn's body was found in Sydney Harbor, shot dead. You betrayed her, and that's just as bad. <laughs> it is. I know that sounds silly, but it is. It is as bad. I want answers. Now. All in good time. But for now, I must apologize. Sweet dreams, Elliot. Crazy. Okay. Okay, so I know we got the checkpoint. Uh, let me pause my recording real quick and I'll be right back. I'll be right back. How do I do this? <laughs> hmm. Okay, now here's the thing. I'm going to be honest. Here's the thing. I could pause my recording, but that would mean I would have to do some editing. Uh, and I'm not sure if I want to. So... That is the end of this episode, but I'm going to record the next part right now. Usually I go back to the menu. No, let me go back to the menu for this. Uh, return to title screen. Okay. <laughs> okay, one sec. <laughs> you can tell this is a little impromptu. Okay, so I just finished episode 6, 
and I'm about to do episode 7 right now, like literally right now. Um, but I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to be honest, I'm going to be a bit lazy here. I don't want to have to edit the two parts together. Because um, if I do that, then I have to render out this video and that actually takes a couple hours. Uh, when normally once I finish this, I can just upload the raw, the raw footage. And that's, that's just way quicker. It's just convenient on my end. Um, but no, I am going to record the next part right now. The reason I'm not recording them both together is because I'm a little paranoid. My laptop crashes sometimes and I don't want to lose any footage. I've never had that issue recording anything yet. And I am super grateful. I'm super grateful. I'm genuinely, it's very stressful. <laughs> Uh, it's stressful for me because I want to capture all of this. So, yeah, I'm going to end it now, but the next part should be uploaded immediately. Immediately. Um, I will be finished with this game by the time you're watching this video. Um, but no. I'm Lovely. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.